Hey everyone, today we're going to show you how to connect Bluetooth devices to your Windows 10 PC. We're going to connect a Bluetooth mouse as well as some Bluetooth earbuds. It's super easy and quick, so check it out. Hey everyone, welcome to Northern Viking Everyday. If you are new here, my name is Ken and we bring you videos on reviews and how-tos, so make sure you click that subscribe button so you don't miss out on upcoming videos. Today we're going to show you how to connect your Bluetooth devices to your Windows 10 computer. It's super easy to do. We're going to be connecting a Bluetooth mouse as well as some Bluetooth earbuds that I picked up. So let's head on over to my computer desktop and show you how it's done. All right, so I'm going to be using my old mouse here to navigate the computer so we can connect that Bluetooth mouse and earbuds to the computer. So the first thing we need to find is the Bluetooth menu on the computer. So there's a couple different ways to do that. Find your search bar here at the bottom and you can go ahead and type in Bluetooth or start typing it in. And you're gonna see an option here that says Bluetooth and other device settings. You could go ahead and left click on that to select that and that would open up the menu. Or the other way, just here at the bottom left, click on the start menu, the Windows logo. And on the left hand side here, you're gonna see a little gear that says settings. When you click on that, it's going to bring up a whole new Windows settings page for you. And we're looking for the option here at the top that says devices, Bluetooth, printers, mouse. And if you go ahead and left click on that, it's going to bring up the Bluetooth and other devices menu for you. Now, if you don't see the screen that looks exactly like this, you may have selected one of these options on the left hand side, printer scanners, mouse, touchpads, etc. Make sure that you have the Bluetooth and other devices option selected. So now I do want to say before we can go ahead and start connecting our device, we need to make sure that our devices are going to be able to get into pairing mode. And you might have to check in your instructions how to get your device into pairing mode. Basically what pairing mode is, is it puts your device in a mode so that two devices can talk to each other. So the computer and the mouse, that they can talk to each other and connect to one another. So um, we need to find out how to get that into pairing mode. Just read your instructions. Every device is a little bit different. This one, for example, I have to turn on and then there's a little connect button that I have to push. And for the Bluetooth earbuds on these ones, I have to just pull out only the right hand earbud and it'll automatically go into pairing mode when it doesn't connect to anything. So there's a couple different options there to do that. So on your computer here, the couple things we need to do is make sure that our Bluetooth is turned on. If it's off, your devices will not connect. So there's a little toggle switch here that you can click on and it'll turn on your Bluetooth. Now when you turn that on, if you, if you don't have Bluetooth on your computer, it's not going to work. So you need to make sure your computer does have Bluetooth. I'm, I'm assuming your computer does if you're trying to connect devices to it. Some older Windows 10 computers may not have Bluetooth in them. But um, if you do have Bluetooth, that's perfect for connecting your devices because you do need that. Next up, we need to get our device into pairing mode. So on my mouse here, I'm just going to turn it on and then click the connect button, hold that down. And actually the light at the bottom is going to start blinking. And we need to go ahead and click add Bluetooth device here. And then we need to select Bluetooth, mice, keyboards, pens, audio. So this is the one we need to select. We can select that and it's going to start searching for devices and make sure your device is turned on and discoverable, select the device below to connect. So my device is right there, Bluetooth mouse 4.0. I'm just gonna go ahead and select that. And it says connecting. And all of a sudden your device is ready to go. And I've got, oh, my mouse is freaking out here. You can see it all going all over the screen. So now I can use that new mouse and it's gonna work. So your device is ready to go, Bluetooth mouse 4.0 done and in the corner it says device is ready it's actually behind my face there in the corner so I can click done and that's done so my mouse is all good now we're gonna go ahead and I can actually use my new mouse now so we're gonna go ahead and connect these Bluetooth um, earbuds so again we're gonna click on that plus and you can you just need to make sure it's discoverable at the same time as the computer so again we're gonna click on Bluetooth um, mice, keyboards, pens, etc. I'm going to pull out the right earbud because that's how we get this into discoverable mode or pairing mode. So you can see it's starting to blink red and blue on these ones. And I'm going to click on Bluetooth and add a device. And this one's going to have to search a little bit longer here, it looks like. And there it is X10-R is the audio device. I'm just going to click on that. And it says connecting and 
press connect if the pin on the X10-R matches this one. And um, in my instructions, it does have that pin. So we are good to go and connect. So we're just gonna hit connect. And it says your device is ready to go. And again, behind my picture there in the corner, it says set up, setting up device. We're setting up the device and device is ready to go. It says in the bottom corner on my screen. So we're just gonna hit done and we are good to go. My earbuds are connected and my mouse is connected. And it's super simple to connect your devices to a Windows 10 computer. So I hope this video did help you out in connecting all your Bluetooth devices. If it did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also remember to subscribe to Northern Viking every day because I've got tons of videos coming up that I would love to share with you. Thanks so much for watching today and take care.